and welcome to Nina Shanice TV and today I'm bringing y'all back with another video so y'all can see about a title down below I'm finna give y'all an Amazon review because man y'all I've been looking for some good 613 hair for my birthday and I couldn't like I can't find any at all like it's so hard finding some when you're really trying to get it on time so I was like okay let me order my first Amazon wig so today I'm gonna give y'all a review of my first impression on the hair you know some i feel like some of these youtubers don't really be honest so i'm gonna just let y'all know the real deal and then i'm gonna also take y'all on a tour on how i'm gonna dye the hair so this is how the package came in right y'all you know amazon the regular amazon packaging and then the hair came like this right okay and it's funny y'all because i already opened it but when I opened it, I was like, you know what? This needs to go on YouTube because, like I said, these YouTubers are not honest with their reviews. So, I might as well just give y'all what y'all really need to hear. You feel me? When I open this, this is what the box looked like. 100% human hair, right? Regular wig packaging, you know, with all the stuff. This is the wig. This is the wig caps, you know. But, um, y'all, let me show y'all something. This little sticker right here, I don't know if y'all can see it. Okay, this little sticker right here, it tells you, it tells me basically what I ordered. So it says 613 T part body weight lace front human hair wig, 28 inches, 150% density, right? Okay, so let's get to the wigs because. F the packaging. Let's get to the wig. So, y'all. When I took this hair out the box. First of all, this is my first time doing T-part. So, I was kind of hesitant on buying it. But I didn't really see no good ones that were not T-part. This video is not sponsored. They did not pay me for this. So, this is like my honest review. And... Before I purchased, I was really, I was really looking for a really good wig. So I would go through all the reviews and every single wig I looked at, people are like, don't buy this wig. Oh my God, this wig sheds. And this, and this one also had its cons, but it had more pros than cons. So I was like, all right, let me give it a try. Cause you know, what if my experience isn't as bad as everybody else's? This is a T part. Let me show y'all the inside. If y'all don't know what a T part is right here, I can only do a middle part right so it has the combs has four combs one right here right here right here and here it has a little adjustable bands and i feel like for this to be 150 density it's kind of i'm not gonna lie it's kind of thin it's like super thin you know but i mean it's not bad and then for it to be 28 inches i feel like it is kind of short i don't really feel like it's true to its length if that makes sense this but i mean i can customize it to my liking you know and then i want you guys to see this too the knots are really really the sun is just in my way the knots are really really bold but i mean it's body wave so when I stretch it, I mean, it does go a little longer. So maybe if I was to straighten it, it would go a little longer. But yeah, let me see. Because this head, it doesn't shed that much. Oh, matter of fact, actually it does. Wow. Okay. It's not like uncontrollably shedding. Like, oh my gosh, I have to send this back. Every time I comb through it, it's like a strand, just one strand. It's not really much to worry about, but I will be doing a, like a six month update review on this hair, you know, because, you know, when you first get it, it ain't the same as when you start using it all the time. You know, shedding, shedding is real different because best believe I used to, I would get hair in this shed like crazy, but yeah y'all it's soft though it doesn't really have a smell um rate this hair one through ten i'll say right now like a seven eight it's not awful 
like I said, this is all the shedding I've gotten so far. It's not really much. Unlike other 613 hairs, like it sheds awfully, like horribly. But y'all, let's get into the dyeing part because this is the second time I'm dying a wig. If y'all haven't seen on my Instagram last year, I also dyed a 613 wig, but I did a ginger color. And everybody loved it and wondered how did I dye it? How did I do this? So today I'ma show y'all. So let's get to the video. <laughs> official review of this hair y'all see that i dyed it i dyed it styled it tried to curl it a little bit and it's not ugly i like it it's really really cute let's say one out of ten now that i've actually used it put it on styled it and all of that i'll say the eight nine yes it does shed it does shed but it's not like a shed where like you can't control the hair you can't control it. You got to send it back. Oh my gosh, it's shedding a lot. It is a little thin. I'm not going to lie. It is a little thin. I don't know if you guys can tell, but look, that's it. But it's cute. I'm not going to... I don't think I'll be wearing this for too long. But it is cute. If y'all want the hair, the link is down below. So I tried to pluck it as best as I could. And this is this is the, the most I plucked. And the hair still looks good. I didn't want to pluck it too much because, you know, it's the tea part. And I don't want nothing to look bald. But, I mean, on the other hand, the hair is good. Besides the shedding, it's good. It's cool. I'll buy it again if I want to try to recolor or re-dye re hair. Don't, the only time I buy 613 hair is when I want to dye it. So, And also, if y'all want a video of me on how I install my wigs, I will upload that for y'all, but just let me know down below if that's what y'all want, because I'll give y'all that. Last but not least, look at Cece. Last but not least, y'all, like, share, comment, subscribe. I hope y'all like the review. If y'all want me to do more reviews on here, my honest review, like not promoted with my own money bought hair, let me know, because I will make these videos for y'all. Like, share, comment, subscribe. I'm Nina Shanice, and I'm out.